Highlight. Well, yes, a highlight. How about that? We're nice. staying here for. Yeah, let's stick around here. Uh, Argentina and. Take a look here. We were focusing on the guys for a while. Look at, mm. Let's look at a couple of these matches uh, for uh, the ladies here at under 63. Maybe that was the problem. We were focusing too much on the men here, and the ladies are providing a little bit more. But it's still the early rounds. You expect sort of some of those seeding mismatches. That, That's uh, right. Yeah. No, I, I, even the first few matches we were tuned in, it was a little bit flat. I don't mm. know, it was our choices or... Well, just watching that first hour, I thought there was a, quite a mixture between good Epons and three or four I saw Hans Kamakes out the back door. <laughs> you know, so there was this variation that right, was occurring, right. yeah. Let's see here, we have uh, Bermholm from Sweden versus Lopez of Argentina. So one thing the crowd has been doing the last two or three days, is they've been supporting some of uh, the Pan American players as well, especially the South Americans. Let's see if this crowd gets behind Lopez. As we're working on the first minute already done, and there's no scores and no penalties. We saw Bermhold's uh, teammate there earlier on. Uh, was it uh, Hermanson who took care of uh, Mohamed Segrel of Poland? And there's a first penalty going out now to Lopez. gripping look, but that uh, Bermal seems to be more of the aggressor. We're getting a couple little leg taps there by Lopez, and oh, all of a sudden she finds a gripping situation to her liking, but I'd like to see her turn in a little bit. Well, yeah. A little more a, commitment. Well, there's a funny yeah. a funny position there she was in. I think it looked like she just got underneath an elbow, perhaps, mm, yeah. twisted the upper mm. body. But nice then little, yep. she didn't control herself very well yeah. there, lost her balance and G gave away gave the, away the yeah. throw. So a nice entry. Yeah. Just it, for the people out there watching, when they see the gi with the IGF on it, it's because they have failed the test. The gi um, check. The gi check. Uh, and means, which means they can wear the IGF gi, but the coach is not allowed to sit in the chair. Oh, really? Yeah. I was not aware of that so second part. So the coach is penalized. For having the illegal for, gi. For allowing the player to appear with an illegal gi. Interesting. Which is good because it means the player is just out, you know? Right, right, um, right. Which is a bit harsh. But, uh, yeah. And it be, should be something the coach or his staff yeah. should keep tabs on. Sure. And I think the second time it happens, 